All right, coming up next here, folks, this has been brewing on since the opening press conference of Seawood Valley Wrestling back in 2018. The Immaculate Race Saint Jean and Big Daddy D Roy have a score to settle. The Immaculate Race Saint Jean, the new Police oh, oh, Wrestling oh, Alliance oh, heavyweight yeah. champion. This is what a real champion looks oh. like. This is the Randy and Ray show now. <laughs> Ray St. Jean, the only thing that eclipses this man's talent is his ego. Unfortunately, I gotta give the devil his due, and that man brings a lot of success all over the world. He's been collecting titles everywhere amongst Canada, and here, not endearing himself, as we can see the bevy of multicolor signs. The disrespect they're showing the immaculate one here in Cornwall, here at Seaway Valley Wrestling, not showing respect to the OV, OWA champion. Look at the physique on the Immaculate One. Rick Saint, I mean, Ray Saint Jean, not unfamiliar with Seawood Valley Wrestling here. Him and Big Daddy D Roy do have a history at the first inaugural Seawood Valley Wrestling. Big Daddy D Roy getting the win over Saint Jean here. This is for the OWA championship. They did get approval from the company to put this title on the line. This is a no DQ street fight. Cornwall street fight straight out of the East End, folks. A little afraid here, a little skeptical of Randy Barry being inside, especially in a no DQ matchup. This street fight, as you call it. I hope he doesn't interfere in this matchup. As we know, Dr. Bob, the numbers game is always an important factor. Randy Barry well known in the Seaway Valley region for his consistent interruptions and infractions. A lot of people trying to pin that against him, but he's a man with a legend behind him. A couple and weeks ago, they did go on the Ron Begg show on your TV. They had some choice words for Ron Begg, but they did get a nice standoff here with Big Daddy D-Roy. They did have a no contact clause. They could not physically have an altercation until this very moment. So I'm sure Big Daddy d roy has been salivating to try to get his hands on the Immaculate One. Big time pro wrestling champion, Big Daddy d roy coming out. He came equipped. Not only a garbage can and a chair, but what looks like a solid one-piece hockey stick that is not a two-piece stick. That will not break, folks. That will do some damage. I don't know about that. Don't make promises. Uh, big Daddy T-Roy is the big-time pro wrestling champion. The belt is not on the line. Only the OWA championship. The back of it one, Ray St. Jean, looking to keep his hands on that title. Showing his distaste for garbage cans. The oh! Already. Here we go. Already. 
He's got to watch that Kane as well, getting his hands on Randy Berry. Sejal playing the clothesline. Here we go. It's a great thing we have senior ref. There's St. Denis in there. He's called a lot of hardcore matches, a lot of street fights. And you know that we're going to need someone with experience to contain the chaos that we are about to see. One might see Big Daddy d -Roy and think he's not very athletic. The man plays hockey. He plays defense in hockey. One would not want to be in the corner when he comes at you on blades. You know what he also does? He professionally wrestles. He's a champion, Mark. He is the big-time pro wrestling champion. I have one question, and only one I question. The chair. Oh! Dodges that. Chair first. Hey, listen to this, folks. Ow! Take a seat, Rick! Big Daddy starting us off with a question. Who's your daddy, Ray? That on is eight by ten. The crowd loving this, chanting one more time. Oh, using the rough end of the chair. Yeah, I know Ray St. John, unfortunately, very, very well. And this matchup has been on the top of his list. He's wanted this ever since it was announced last show and talking about this nonstop. This means the world to him to win oh. tonight. Big Daddy Deaver looking to take out the Look trash here. Unfortunately, Ray's shoulder's a little bit too big to fit in there. I don't know if that Cornwall budget is going to allow this kind of trash removal when we change it up next year. Oh. Deroy grabbing the hockey stick here, putting the trash can back. Oh! oh! He's going to be hearing that one for days. You see that, Smarky? There's birds flying around the Immaculate One's head right now. When they suddenly appear, every time. They kick out Randy Berry. Coming up on ringside here, spits his gum. Oh, the no. disrespect on Big Daddy D. -Roy. Why would you try to antagonize a man the size of Big Daddy D. Roy? Randy Berry is doing the manager's job, ensuring that his client has the best possible opportunity. Begging, Looking pleading for, with Big Daddy D. Roy. Time out here. Look out, folks! Oh, oh what a chair shot! The yeah. immaculate one getting the offense here. Capitalizing. Sound like hitting a brick wall. That upper body strength of Ray St. Jean on display here with those chair shots. Posting continuously if you follow him on any of his social media, his immaculate daily workout regime. Why right would you? Kid. Time to bake some cookies. Oh! Open the oven. Those cookies are done. Daddy D. Roy laying on the mat, the immaculate one, grabbing the uh, the baking sheet yet again, and another oh. hit. Look at the dent that put in the baking sheet. Well, that's no good for anything else. He's blatantly choking here. There are no rules here, folks. This is a no disqualification street fight. Anything oh. is going to happen here. Pinfall or submission. Randy Berry getting involved here with some of the audience. Randy shouldn't be putting his hands on any of our great fans here in Cornwall. We do apologize about that, folks. O.W.A. belt. The O.W.A. belt. Looking to not lose that title tonight. Ow. Big belt hit in the head. That's it. Big Daddy D-Roy looks like he's knocked out here. Big pin. One, two. Wow. Never count out the champion, Mark. But the Immaculate One wants to put this down. He's not ready. He's not done delivering one. that pain. The Immaculate Ray, One. What's Barry's doing up here? Where's the bell? We got it. What do you, what do you think? This, right we don't have a bell up here. Where is it? I think it's over there. You're on the wrong side. You gotta side. go for a walk. You're on the wrong side, Barry. Randy Barry trying to get in our faces here. Barry working on his cardio now. Apparently, we're going to send him. Notice that the cane is not anywhere to be found. It's just for show, folks. While champion, the Immaculate One, delivering garbage can strikes to the back of oh. Big Daddy D-Roy. What a strike by the Immaculate One. Randy Berry getting the ring bell. I know what you are, but what am I, Mark? A garbage man. It's a Simpsons reference, Bob. You might not know that. The match is not over, folks. Correct. This is not an official end Ray Saint Jean thinking. I don't think anyone was confused by that. But oh, he kicked out goes the bell. No effect on Big Daddy D Roy. 
This matchup turning about to be such a piercing sprawl. I'm amazed at the amount of plunder in this ring already. Whether you've been walking down Alice Street on First Street, Prince Arthur, or St. Felix, you're not ready for this Cornwall Street fight. Ring oh. the bell! Oh. He's leading! All right! twice oh one for each each one it's a family show dr bob those are sharp f's from that bell action spills to the oh. other side here crowd's got to look out here almost crashes this right is a street a fight things going are going to get road. insane as we're seeing what's happening here the folks have started to part like look the rest of the side on the side Oh, and there's Randy, Randy Barry. Barry with the cane again, yeah, no, providing yeah. a great distraction. We're all aware now that the cane is officially a weapon and not a walking stick. Could be both. Why can't it be both? It seems to be walking fine without it, Smark. Spilling on the crowd security here. The now, event staff following them. Both main eventers making their way to the merch table. We're seeing. They're dropping them right in front of our special guest, Vanessa Craven. I mean, better save your shirts while they're at it. Yeah. SOS, save our shirts. Available for order where? Online. Big Daddy d -Roy, he's got him here. Bringing the Immaculate One back into the ring slowly. Randy Berry, nowhere to be seen. I think he's still sprawled out after that strike by Daddy. Thank goodness. Back in the ring we go, folks. There's... The Immaculate One getting his way back in. Big Daddy D-Roy. Well, one side the other, just leaving. Here's Randy again. Barry with the cane. Prepared for what's happening on the other side. D-Roy with some vicious kicks. Randy Barry attempting to get involved here, but not wanting to go face-to-face -face with D-Roy. Always looking to hit him from behind there, Smart. But D-Roy made well aware that this is a not a one-on-one -on -one match, so he has to manage the manager. Oh, oh. into the wooden stairs. Oh. That thud you just heard was human flesh, Ow. human bone, just wailing. against wood. We oh, have been attacking Big Daddy t here on the outside. Delivering the lid of that steel garbage can over and over to the back of D-Roy. Randy Berry looking under the ring. Is that, is that a table? That's it's not a door. door! It's a door! How does he have a door? What is happening? How the Immaculate One can have honor in winning a one-on-one -on -one fight with Randy Berry attacking all the time. Now, I do not think that Ray St. Jean's win here was going to be without controversy, but I don't know it was going to be two-on-one for an entire matchup. What a disadvantage as they put Big Daddy in. I heard that Ray St. Jean wanted to break down doors, but I didn't think this is what he meant. He when to break down doors. He wants to put Big Daddy D going through a door. Somebody call John Morrison. Oh, and Ray, Big Daddy becoming absolutely That's how he defeated him last time. One, two. Oh, 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 oh what's oh, going oh. on? Oh. Serge Sanity takes a hockey slash to the back of the neck. He is out. That man has a family. Five-minute misconduct for Randy Barry. This is no joking matter. How dare you? That man has just been a that he's a referee here at Seaway Valley West, and we do not condone those actions. That is five minutes for slashing and a game misconduct. We're seeing here Randy Berry taking some big kicks onto champion Ray St. Jean, delivering another kick to down referee Serge St. Denis. Calling for the immaculate elbow here. We know that this is a no disqualification match, but. This is chaos. Randy Berry holding oh, Sejan no. off. What's he going for? Oh, no. no I think I know again. what's coming. Who puts these things under the ring? Oh, oh no. no. He said oh, no. He said he wanted him higher. And this is how you get higher. When you want to be immaculate, you reach to the heavens. Speaking and of if we have higher, to our next Cedar Valley Wrestling Show is on April 20th. Look forward to the high impact in April. Setting up the ladder here. 
Grace St. Jean. Randy Berry still looking for more toys underneath the ring. I'm absolutely disgusted how this has just become a handicap matchup. How is the commissioner not watching on right now backstage, calling on someone? Now, and I know Big Daddy has signed off for this, but have, still. Sorry, having a two-on-one match and a no-DQ is totally fair, but attacking the officials completely out of hand. Once again, Mark, this is a street fight from the streets of Cornwall, walking up Montreal Road through Water Street, whether you want to cut up or down Lesia, or even if you're down on Bedford, this is how it goes down in a street fight. Apparently, Randy Berry building a house here. No windows, only doors. The doors are on sale for $27.99. I believe I see a sticker on the side. They got them for a bargain here in Cornwall. Jim Morrison would be rolling in his graves right now. But you made that joke already. Going for three doors now. I tried John. It was wrong. We're not breaking through the other side yet. This could be Big Daddy D-Roy's kryptonite as we have three doors possibly going down in the ring. And a superhuman effort going to be needed. This is just turning into a mugging. I don't, I, I'm confused as to how Commissioner LA has not sent in another official here. This match could end at any moment. We don't have a referee to make the three count. Thankfully, nobody has gone for a pin as of yet since referee Serge St. Denis has been knocked out. Total destruction is going to be required to get a win here. Total door destruction coming up. Randy Berry picking up Big Daddy D-Roy here. Assuming he's going to be putting them on the two stacked tables. Oh, no. oh no. The doors are underneath the gargantuan weight of Big Daddy D-Roy. And here's more weight coming down. An immaculate elbow, perhaps. Ask not for whom the door knocks for, because it knocks for thee. Ray St. Jean knocking the danger. D-Roy getting driven inside the tables. What an immaculate elbow off the ladder. Straight into Big Daddy D-Roy's heart, it looked like. Folks, that might not have been the result that those two had wanted, but effective nonetheless. Oh, absolutely. There's no part of that that Big Daddy D-Roy enjoyed. Daddy is stirring at this point, but he has not moved. D-Roy needs to get on what? I, I just about to say there was a little bit of life in senior official there, but Randy Berry deciding that it's not his time to get back up. Oh, oh what the? Look Look Randy the Berry, D-Roy trying to fight Look back. Heart. Look in the heart of Big Daddy D-Roy trying to fight back. Let's see here, double choke slam, double maneuver. Oh my God! Choke slammed through the door. We have no referee to take the count, though. Here's the problem. There's the sign. Two. Oh! Big Daddy D Roy kicks out in two. Out. The crowd is loving this, folks. One would have to wonder if Serge wasn't in such a bad state if that could have been the end of that matchup, and they have no one to blame but Randy Berry for that. Setting up the third door in the corner. Immaculate one calling for it one more time. Could this be enough? But no! And he chokes him in the mouth! Oh! He's got to pin him. He's got to pin him. Randy Berry looking worried outside. The Royal looks to be setting something up. Some reinvigoration in the champion. There's no referee to go for the cover, so he's putting his attention on Randy Berry here. And D-Roy showing exactly what a champion is made of. A lesser man, a lesser wrestler. That would have been the end of that. Randy Berry coming back in with that hockey stick. Misses! Big punch down goes Berry. Oh, no. Big Daddy D-Roy looking to go on the offense. What were you with saying? With a twig. Decided not to go with the hockey stick. Oh! What, what kind of a dust was just exposed to Big Daddy D-Roy? 
baby powder or something. He's blinded here. Randy Berry picking That's up Taylor Hey, wait. Are you man? seeing this? Oh, oh my God. D-Roy being absolutely through the chair. I don't know if you heard Thanos' snap, but he just got dusted. That Death Valley driver, a Seaway Valley driver, to be apropos here, and might that be the end of the very great hanging to stand? Great yeah. work by manager Randy Berry. It can't end like this. No. It can't end it's like this. It's no. 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 Don't damn you. Hey, and that's the. Are you? Is that really what's happening? Damn you, Randy Berry. Damn, damn, damn you. you, Rick Stanger. Are you kidding me? A lifeless Ray Stanger gets put on top of Team Roy by his damn manager, wakes up the official for the three count, and the OWA championship stays around the waist of the Immaculate One. This is far from over. The bad blood has not even begun. And I think that these two have a long and storied feud coming up. Chapter two just ended. I'm sure it's not the final. There is no way that this chapter is over between these men. This was an intense, intense street fight. And I'm sure that new double champion, Ray St. Jean, will not let this. Uh, this wasn't for the big time pro wrestling belt there, no. Sparky. He does keep his OWA belt. Thankfully, the big time pro wrestling championship was not on the line. The immaculate one, Ray St. Jean, coming up victorious in a huge Cornwall no DQ street fight. Grabbing the belt and just leaving, not allowing Big Daddy Tiro to come back up. I don't blame him either. Taking full advantage of the opportunity as he's got it. Folks, this was this was an amazing show. We want to thank every single person here that came to the NAF Center here for Seaway Valley Wrestling presents Love Hurts. Our next event will be on April 20th. Uh, just a couple sponsors here. You can find them all online. Uh, off Your Rocker, Seaway Hyundai, NAF Center, Drop Dead Thread, Fantasy Realm, Fresh Co., Furniture, Mattress, Warehouse, I want to thank every single person for Dr. Bob. I am Marky Mark. And I'm the man they call the Smark. And we will see you here April 20th for more Seaway Valley Wrestling Action.